Professor Odile Eisenstein is a towering figure in modern chemistry and one of the most influential chemists worldwide. Her research in the fields of catalysis, organometallic and organic synthesis is groundbreaking, impacting applications for real-life problems. She is currently Emeritus Research Director of the National Center for Scientific Research in France and adjunct professor at the University of Oslo. Odile is a good friend of Technion, having spent a month as a visiting lecturer at the Schulich Faculty of Chemistry, where she collaborates with Professors Yitzchak Apoloig and Ilan Marek. She strongly promotes Israeli scientists as a member of the Scientific Advisory Board of the World Association of Theoretical and Computational Chemists. Roald Hoffman, 1981 Nobel Laureate in Chemistry and Technion Honorary Doctor, describes Odile as a superb theoretician, whose work is the best interaction of theory and experiment that he's ever seen. Odile has been honored globally and is the first woman to be elected to the chemistry section of the French Academy of Sciences in 50 years. She is the second foreign citizen to receive the American Chemical Society's Organometallics Award. She was nominated to the French Legion of Honor and named Officier de l'Ordre du Mérite, one of the highest distinctions of the French Republic. I am what is known a computational chemist. So a computational chemist doesn't do experiment. A computational chemist is going to try to model the reality. So what does that mean? He's going to try to represent what the experimental chemist does in his part. He does it in his computer. And he can do that in a computer because indeed he knows how to represent molecules with appropriate mathematics. So I do that in collaboration with my colleague, experimental chemist, and together we try to understand how molecules transform into each other. And it feels very good when you are able to propose an interpretation and even sometimes predict. The first time I visited Israel, I was a student. It was in 1974. And after that, I was invited other several times. So I develop friendship with people. I have uh, collaboration and I enjoy and I feel like in a family. Technion is very special. Technion is one of the absolutely best places of learning uh, of the world. And receiving a honor of such a place feels really extremely good. You feel humble and extremely honored. Another reason is that one of the person who has received a similar honor is one of my mentors, Rolf Hoffman, Nobel Prize in 85. And just being in his step is something fantastic. So I'm very pleased to go back to Technion and meet my friends and colleagues there.